still bright outside. We made it to the airport. Well, okay, we're in the parking garage, but we made it. Bye, LA. Present to you your remote. <laughs> <laughs> this is so excessive. What the? <laughs> is there two toilets too? That'd be funny. Yay! Shower bath. Oh, this is a shower. Oh my god, what a cool shower. Okay, we are finally in Cabo and I'm just hungry, so I'm gonna go out like this. So hungry. It's supposed to be my second meal by this time. Go up somewhere and find some cheap Mexican food. Oh, it be so good. I want some like seafood. Nachos and Mexican pizzas. Bum, bum. Like soap. You want to bite it first? <laughs> you want me to test it? Yeah. Wait, what's the letter say? Oh yeah, I didn't read it. Welcome, here's soap. Look at the lizard! Oh, it's gone! Come back! What the? Oh, what the? <laughs> the shoe. He's lounging. Why is his arm like that? I don't know. Hello? Probably. Oh. Wow! Whoa! Dang, so that means they can just like sneak in. It's emotional, sobbing into her hands. Feeling some guilt for killing these so-called creatures. What? <laughs> when you zoom in, you can see everything. It's so pretty. Steve. <laughs> Look, oh, cactus. Oh, pretty. Oh, we'll come back here later. We're heading to Cabo San Lucas. I think like uh, San Jose Cabo San Lucas, which is like the town center. I don't know if it's gonna be open though, cause it's like six o'clock right now. But we're gonna go there and explore. Dude, I woke up at like six a.m. today. I'm so tired. And then tomorrow, oh, I can't wait for tomorrow. Tomorrow we're gonna go to ooh. Turning, 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 turning. All right, we're going into some ho fancy hotel. We got in. Fast security. Oh, wow. Yes. <laughs> no, we're, oh, it's pretty short. <laughs> it's very secure here. Oh, yeah. That's like two doormen. Do you have battery? <laughs> no. Seems about the same. Cheese. Mmm, that's really good. It just has alcohol in Actually, it. Actually, right? it's like not not too sweet. That's like my perfect sweet level. Mm -hmm. I can't tell if it's sweet or sour. <laughs> here. I don't know where everyone is. They're all sleeping, I guess. Dude, I'm so tired though. I'm gonna go to sleep. We walked around Los Cabos San Lucas and uh, it's really cool at night. It's like an art district. Good morning! It's a beautiful day today in Cabo 
and the waves are crashing right now. You guys can see it. Oh my god, this is so cool. Ah, this is so cool. I'm doing my makeup this morning and we're just gonna get ready. This is my little setup that I have. I'm gonna sit there, have this amazing view, sit on the floor. Got a little pillow right there and YouTube. Good morning! Well, I already say good morning, but we're gonna head out to Flora Farms now. I'm excited. It's gonna be a cooking class. Oh god, it's so oh god, it's so bright. In Cabo, it is so humid. My lips are nice and plump again. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I love it. I feel hydrated. <laughs> I don't feel all wrinkly here. Thank you for getting breakfast. It's so hot. I like it, this is perfect. It's just too bright for me. Oh, they're leading the other. He's eating the McDonald's! He's eating the tron! Oh! Oh, so good! Oh. <laughs> Flora Farms is a farm to table. This is Mexican farm to table, so they grow their own gardens and stuff. I think you pick it and then we get to make food with it. Oh my god. <laughs> I sort of want to drive two hours marine conservative area where uh, they can serve the wildlife and you can go there and kind of just like see the animals that are there yeah I'm like oh it is green yeah it's like it's a little forest manufactured it's forest <laughs> it's about like a three-hour thing that we signed up for for cooking class and probably just chill it's organic where, where are we where are we and uh, we opened the cooking classes in 2008 Going on a tour now. Halloween got married here. And uh, also for papayas, you're gonna see that we have different kinds. Another thing that helps us save. It's amazing because it grows up. It's hot in here. This is the mango they grow on the farm. Just finished our cooking class and now we're gonna, I don't know, I think I kind of want to make that two hour drive even though we have a very uh, janky car and we might be stuck. But yeah, there's just like butterflies and everything just casually just flying around everywhere. Birds, there's chickens. Fishies! <laughs> Definitely bringing the umbrella this time because it's so so hot in there. Uh, my hair, I just put it up because it's too freaking hot. And then new outfit change. You're so cute. Look at this. Look at the slit. Ah, oh, the slit. Okay. We changed your mind. We're not gonna go to the two-hour thing because it's gonna be a little late to get there. Um, but we're gonna go to the lovers' beach, divorce beach around that area. That's I think that's like the main Cabo San Lucas area where all the um the party people go. We're like in the quiet older people section and family. So I do love this area though. I recommend staying here if you just want to just chill, but let's go to the beach. The beach, beach. We are in this two jetter. Super Asian auntie. I got my Asian sun hat on. I got from Chinatown and then, oh, look at this umbrella. It's doubled. Look at that. Yeah. Blur Farms is 
pretty pricey, but in my opinion, since we're from LA, it was worth it because you got to see all the animals. The cooking part was cool as well. Although they mostly did most of the cooking for you, they kind of just tell you how to do it. The experience is really fun, I did enjoy it, but like I said, I just enjoyed being in the nature more than anything. They called it a farm oasis. I feel like we're in Pokemon land. There's like butterflies, there's birds everywhere, bees, like, so cool. There's so much nature here. Why are we living in LA? We missed all the excursions because you had to book it kind of early, but it's okay, we're just gonna head there. The current is pretty strong right now. I do want to go snorkeling, but it seems like eh, they, they ain't really going snorkeling right now. I don't know, and I can't really swim either, so. How's your food? Yeah. <laughs> okay, look at that. So cool. Alright, we're here. Wow, look at these rocks. Is this all like underwater or some shit? Wow. Are back in our car that was uh that was pretty hectic then we ended up doing a water taxi thing old, like lover's beach divorce beach it was really hot um they they closed at five o'clock which i didn't know so we were like really rushed to do everything it was like okay we're gonna do a quick little tour and then like you get like 15 minutes on the beach and they get to see some fishes that was really cool there's so many fish there so i'm really sad that we didn't get to snorkel oh and the water taxi was about 30 per person um yeah it's okay price uh dennis says that it's pretty normal around here it's just that I wish we got to stay at the Lover's Divorce Beach longer, so that would have been really cool. Now we're going to head back uh, to the hotel because I have to pee really bad. I don't want any. I know, I thought you were just doing it for the video. No! Yum, is exactly what I wanted. Oh, this is so cool. someone's dog. I'm gonna miss walking through here. Such a grand entrance. I don't think the video does it justice. Like, look how tiny he is compared to... <laughs> Especially over there. Even higher ceilings. Yeah, this will never get old. I love this place. 